Alright guys, um, I'm testing out a new review system here. Uh, it might not be my, uh, nor my normal one, but this is just something I'm testing out. Where I review the individual, uh, volume of a manga. So yeah, um, here's number one of Black Cat, and that's what I'll do with the review of. Uh, volume one of Black Cat, uh, starts with us meeting the two main characters, Train Hartnett and Sven Volvi, whatever. Yeah, his, his last name is missaid a few times in the series, and it's a really weird name. A lot of the characters do have very odd last names. So, if I mispronounce them or just say, yeah, rah, 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 let's, let's go with it. Because they're very weird names. Uh, and they're sweepers. They're that basically they're like bounty hunters, except they can't kill their targets unless specified. Yeah, it sounds pretty gay to me too. Um, well, they have well in the first chapter they have to go around and they f they're eaten. They can't find anybody to get a good bounty on because they're poor and in debt. So pretty much, they go around and then suddenly a bunch of mafia guys show up, shoot up the place and because they want to try to kill this one guy. And the uh, train does this crazy thing where he goes like, oh yeah, I'm crazy, I'm train. Train is a very interesting person. He's very, like, crazy, but at the same time he can be dead serious. Like, he's kind of, like, eccentric, but he's, like, dead serious when he wants to fight. Uh, yeah. So, then... So then they take it's this old guy, he worked for the Mafia, and they take him in. So then, right after that, uh, they go through a plan. He's like, no, I want to go see my family before you turn me in. And Train's like, sure, why not? And so, uh, with the right when they're about to leave, a uh, guy from the Mafia goes and kills him. Dr tr disguises Sven. So then, Train gets really pissed, follows the guy, and beats the living, ever-living shit out of him and kills him. Uh, pretty much, and then they go to the country, the where he the little part, the country where he lived, and put the put a picture of him there in the doorstep and ran away. And then uh, chapter two, I believe I I haven't read this volume in a while, so I can't remember it word part for part. But I'm pretty sure this is where he meets Cleaver, some guy from the organization, which is the backstory of this. Uh, train. Oh, I forgot to mention this. Train was a legendary assassin named the Black Cat. Hence the name of the series, Black Cat. Uh, basically, this picture describes, you can see it, his gun is called Hades. Uh, basically, it's given to a certain amount of sweet of erasers, people who kill people under orders from the organization, more or less. Uh, so, yeah. And uh, he tries to get him, this guy Cleaver tries to get him to go back to the organization, Train says no, they fight, kind of, he kind of, he really just kind of shoots at him, and then Train just pawns him. It's not really a very interesting chapter, otherwise. Uh, so after that, so then they meet, uh, another, the plot for the next volume and a half. Uh, her name's Rinslet Walker, it's, that's her right here on the cover. Kind of, she's an uh, international thief, and she asks them for help. I mean, pretty much, she asks them for help um, to uh, get into this guy named Tornio's mansion. Tornio is some rich ass hat who does a bunch of crazy things, and he we don't really find out until a little later, which is like, and by a little later, I'm like the next freaking chapter. But yeah, uh, I'll go. There's two different parts going on at the same time. There's train and there's train. What's going on with train? What's going on with Sven and Rinslet? Um, I'll go with Train first because I can remember that more vividly. Uh, train goes to the mansion to uh, scope it out, and he find he sees that there's this little girl who is like has who can transform her frigging arm into who has a giant arm sword thing, and she's just pawning people. And Train's are like distraction. Yeah, her name's Eve. She's another vital part of the story. Uh, uh, let me see if I can find a picture of her. I was doing some old stuff here with this. Uh, that's her right, this is Eve right here, uh, just saying. 
So yeah. Uh, eventually they uh, so then train gets goes run around there, and then the right she's one, then it goes to train the Sven and Rinslet waiting for a train, and then tra they Sven calls train and is like, oh god, what the hell? Get out of there! What the hell are you doing? That kind of stuff, typical anime partner stuff, and more or less. Right after that, some other shit happens. This is, like, it's not really important to what happens. Then, uh, Eve gets away when Train gets away. Don't ignore that. <laughs> that was, I thought there was something behind me. I, I'm very paranoid. Uh, yeah. Well, pretty much, yeah. I, forgot, I lost my train of thought now. Shit. Alright. Alright, so Eve gets out. And uh, meets up with Sven. By anime randomness, she just happens to meet up with him, and he gives her ice cream, and kind of talking to her, and he's like, "Oh, we got better turn you to show you the police so they can bring you home." She's like, "I doubt my uncle says the police are asshats." Not really like that, but yeah. Um, then uh, she, they meet up with Tornio. Tornio tells her to kill Sven, and like she stabs him, and she was all like, "Man, I cry." So then they find Sven, and. Uh, Pretty much, they ha they uh, are about to go to Torneo's ma uh, Torneo, and then they find out that um, he's doing a bio weapons with like nano machines and everything, and that's what Eve is, uh, one of his bio weapons. So yeah. So yeah, and then they decide they have to go. Sven trains like Sven, you shouldn't go. You just got owned. And he's like, oh yeah, let's do Russian roulette, and it's like, oh yeah, I'll shoot my hand. Then you pull the trigger and shoot the hand. If you do, if it, if you pull the trigger, you can go. If you don't, can't pull the trigger, you can't go. And he does pulls the trigger, and it turns out it explodes. And everyone, they're like, oh shit, we just blew a hole through Train's hand. And pretty much, he's like, ha, ah, it was a blank bizatch. All right, that's pretty much the entire volume in a nutshell. Um, uh, this is just not the official review system. I'm gonna say this again. This is just another version of it that I want to test out uh, volume by volume. So it might make it easier to review a series if I, like, a short series, like, if I do that. So, yeah, um, uh, for anybody who's interested, uh, leave comments and everything telling me what you think in which version of my reviewing system you like better. Um, it's pretty obvious you're gonna like this one because I don't rant. LOL. Alright, later.